<laughs> What's up, everybody? We are back with another episode of Play With Your Food. Yay. Good job, Ram. Yay. <laughs> um, we have a couple items to show you guys today. One of them was sent in to us by my grandma, which is the one Katie's holding. Um, go ahead and get a closer look at that one. It is Monster Poopers. And there's one of the monsters there. I'm going to hand this one over to Rock so she can see it. This is what it looks like outside the package. This is a different one. And it says that we wind him up after placing the candy in his head there. And the candy should shoot out here from his butt. So, <laughs> let's... um. Let me hold his legs and give him a wind. I think I might have to re-angle this camera, huh? Yeah. There we go. Let's see what happens. Whoa. <laughs> you shot poop everywhere. <laughs> so <laughs> they just went shooting across the table. <laughs> These are what the candies look like. Yeah, that oh, looks like he's constipated. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Um, yeah, go ahead. Wow. <laughs> Those first couple ones just shot out like bullets, and then he got <laughs> constipated and he needed some prune juice. <laughs> so that that is. The monster pooper. Um, should we try the candies? Let's try the candies. Go ahead, let's get one. And one to Auntie. This one Doesn't daddy. really smell like anything. It's up to you, huh? Here. Thank you. I just gobstopper. Well, at least it tastes anyway. Yeah, I was going to say, it's really mm. hard. I tried to bite through it. <laughs> what happened? Yeah, it is. Almost exactly like a gobstopper. Mm hmm. So if you've ever had those, you pretty much know what it tastes like. It's a really hard candy, so you know for little ones, I wouldn't recommend it. Like Roxy's giving to Remy right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got a candy, but yeah, I swear we gotta watch them all day, every day. <laughs> Anyways, back to what we were doing. Um, you want to do the chips next, or that next? Yeah, of course. Oh, you yeah. want the candy. Next candy we got for you guys is another Kinder Candy. And I love Kinder Candies. I'm not usually a chocolate fan, but Kinder always seems to please. This is Kinder Bueno. Uh, white. And it looks like it's got white... Uh, white chocolate? White, white chocolate, yeah. And... I like it. Some other stuff on it. You want to get that one open? I guess not. <laughs> Thought she wanted it. She just turned away from me like, hey, yeah, right. <laughs> this is what it looks hey, like. Daddy. Yes. I was trying to give me like that. One thing I've always liked about Kinder is that they put the... The things into this, like, it's one big candy, you know, but they come in sections. So you can, you know, easily break it apart if you want to share or, you know, whatever. Um, but some candies, they just give you that big hunk of candy bar and you can't, like, well, with us, you know, we can always share with ours. Because we don't eat sweets too often, but when we do, we usually like to split them. And I like how they always make yeah. these where you can break them into individual sections. I'm going to put this down there, Mom. Let's eat this one. Now, I don't... I think that's chocolate on the bottom. It kind of looks like sandpaper. <laughs> you can see a little inside there. There's the filling. And then it has that same rough covering on the top. It smells really good, though. <laughs> Do you want to get one, Peter? No, Remy took it. Oh. That's fine. Here, no, I'll share with Katie. She ain't swallowed it all yet. Here. Can I take a bite? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm good. 
That was nice. So that's the center there. These are so good. Ooh, that is good. That's the white chocolate and the hazelnut in the middle. That's what it is, hazelnut. I was looking for that word. Very tasty. Yeah, that that little bit of chocolate on the bottom really helps. Mm -hmm. So you get a little bit. Of, that's one thing I've always loved about theirs is they mix the white and 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 regular chocolate milk chocolate together. Yeah, and they you can taste each one. Yeah, if you want, let's go ahead. Okay. Yeah, you can taste each one. It's not like you can only taste the milk chocolate or you can only taste the white chocolate. And it has yeah. a wafer around mm -hmm. the whole thing. Yeah, so you get a really nice blend of flavors when you eat those. So, have you ever come across Kinder products? I would suggest picking them up, especially that one. So far, I'd probably say that's one of my favorites. I think so. And I've had quite a few other things, but that one would probably be on the top of my list. What do we got next? You want to do the things next? Oh. You want to do the chips next? Okay. So, for our crisp today, we got Sainsbury Bacon Crispies. That's how they look on the package. Only 96 calories per pack. I guess that's good. I don't know. Not really sure how much you're supposed to get away. But well, I know I usually pack them. <laughs> wow. There we go, Alex. Those okay. got a really strong baking smell. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Yeah, these have a really, really strong baking smell. Oh, they do. Um, <laughs> this is what the. Go ahead, Bubs, this, one. this is what the crisp actually oh, looks like. Almost looks like a piece of bacon, I guess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. It's mine or yours? <laughs> What do you think? It's kind of weird. Oh, it's really salty. That's what I was going to say. I, oh. I, at first it tasted okay until you start chewing on it, and then this like mountain of salt hits you. Mm -hmm. And for those of you who haven't noticed yet, in almost every episode I say a quote from something, so I'm going to say my quote right now. All right. See if you can guess what it is. This is the saltiest thing I've ever eaten, and I want to take a big heaping pull of salt. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> It really is salty. At first, when you when you put it in your mouth, the very first thing you get is a really decent bacon flavor. Mm -hmm. and then once you start chewing, man, it's like I don't, it's almost like they filled the chips with salt, and you bite it, and all the salt gets released. <laughs> <laughs> Beat your tongue up with salt flavor. What do you think, Rox? It was very salty. I think that's what it said. Uh, I like bacon, but I didn't know bacon was really that salty. <laughs> I, mean, I know some bacons do have a cure or salt on them, but that was ridiculous. Mm -hmm. That was, yeah. If you, if, yeah, and I like salty stuff. I know. So for me to say it's salty, it means it's really freaking salty. Especially after we ate that, after we ate the candy. Mm -hmm. I thought it oh, was yeah. good, but oh wow, that's <laughs> really salty. Or after we ate that big bowl of salt. Exactly. <laughs> so. so next we have something. A drink. Robinson summer fruit fruit and barley drink. This is what it looks like. It smells really good. Ah, she's already finished hers. Oh wow! What'd you think, Rox? Very. <laughs> Go ahead, straight off the fruit. We went intense today, man. <laughs> we just went from really salty to extremely sour. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of you can taste. There's a lot of fruits in there, but it gets you right here. Uh, if you wire down a bit more, yeah, yeah that, that's pretty intense. Overall, it's got a good flavor. The fruit flavor is really good, but man, that sour punches you in the face. Holy crap. I sucked on lemons less sour than this. <laughs> Anyways, so, 
We've gone from one extreme to the next. So let's <laughs> let's see what this last thing has in store for us. This one is Rip It Energy Drink. It's a sugar-free energy drink. Oh, I get it. Good job. And it's Citrus X flavored. Yeah. 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 So, let's see what that's got for us. Man, it smells so good. And, and it does taste good at first until that sour hits you. It tastes like an orange. Yeah, no matter how much I drink it, <laughs> it still gets me. <laughs> What's that, buddy? It tastes like an orange drink. That's not bad. Like an orange yeah. soda? Or like a... Yeah. yeah, almost. It tastes like orange Fanta. Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> orange Fanta. As far as its energy level, I'm not sure. We could let you guys know. Well, you've had Rippets before, right? Mm -hmm. What do you think is as far as their boost of energy? It was like a Mountain Dew. Not like it's not as powerful as a uh, monster or anything like that, um, but it's pretty good. What was it Mountain Dew had in it? Wasn't it antifreeze or something like that? I don't know. No. <laughs> it has something in there. I know it was something, and we were like, "What the hell? They put that in there?" Mm -hmm. It was like green on. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. Here I am, bad mouth and mouth, and doing Rossi drinks that crap like crazy. Yep. <laughs> I know it did have something though. It's a lot better than the one that uh, Rossi and I had done or tasted before. The one you had before was plain, right? It yeah. Didn't, it just didn't have any flavor. Yeah, in it. and I thought that was weird to see an energy drink with no yeah. flavor. <laughs> huh? Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah, the problem. It isn't if you like orange Fanta, but we don't yeah. want her it's drinking it. Yeah. So it's yeah. <laughs> Anyways, that's what we got for you this week. We hope you enjoyed it. Um, I would say my pick would be the Kinder Chocolate. Yep, Kinder Chocolate. <laughs> Unless you want extreme salt or extreme sour or orange or Fanta. Orange Fanta. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. Or little monster things pooping on you. <laughs> you got anything else? Oh, yes. Um, when mm. last episode, I talked about Pepto Bismol. And I'm going to talk about it again. The thing is, you're never supposed to have Pepto Bismol before you go to sleep. Because when you wake up, you're going to have a black top. <laughs> well, that's true. Um, there's three ingredients in Pepto Bismol that when mixed with saliva for a long period of time. So turn your tongue, that black color right there. Frida and I had that experience the other day. Mm. <laughs> we took some because our stomachs were a little upset from the meal we ate. Woke up the next morning and both of us had black tongues. <laughs> <laughs> like, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, it was a bit disturbing. Yeah, the last thing you want to see when you first wake up in the morning. Or the first, you, you, know, you don't, you don't want to wake up, stick your tongue out in the mirror to brush your teeth and see it's all black not cool <laughs> so of course we hit the web quick fast like mm -hmm. the hell could have turned my tongue black turned out it was the Pepto yeah so there you go be weary Pepto at night brush your teeth before you go to bed or exactly brush your tongue I should say <laughs> <laughs> I did brush my teeth and it still didn't make a difference <laughs> That's what we got for you this week. We hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to keep playing with your food, and we will see you guys later.